Tonight is do or die for the Springfield Thunderbirds. They must beat the Laval Rocket to advance to the Calder Cup Finals. Win or lose, the crowds the team has been drawing in is a victory for downtown Springfield businesses. As the Thunderbirds gear up for a decisive Game 7 in the AHL Eastern Conference Finals, businesses near the Mass Mutual Center prepare for what is sure to be a busy night. When you're talking a game like this, which is a, the, the final game, you know, it definitely is going to bring a lot of people in the city. And the more people in the city, it means more people in the restaurant. Don't expect to get into Nadim Kashu's popular downtown restaurant Wednesday evening without a reservation. It's always the case. We turn people away, sadly to say, but, uh, you know, we can, you know, we can serve as, as many as we can. In business for 22 years, the past several have been tough as the hard hit hospitality industry works to bounce back from the pandemic. Despite now offering a sign-on bonus and four-day work weeks, Nadim's struggles with staffing. But not only that, it's the price of everything keeps on going up, and this is kind of chewing out of the bottom line for us. Another Main Street business owner is also looking for help. It's very hard to find somebody to. Basically, I really, I need one. The owner of LNA Fine Men's Shop needs to hire a tailor. Right now, he does all sales and sewing himself, including outfitting local hockey players. Four came in just Tuesday for pre-game attire. I have a bunch of them that's come in, and I have a couple of the coach that's come in. Not only this week, but every time they have the game, they come in. I like that, that the first one you did. Picking out a tie on Wednesday is the owner of the commercial real estate company that manages the Mass Live building. I put music on the speakers outside the plaza so that all the people who are coming by the building could see that there's a lot of um, activity and that there's, there's a, a vibe in Springfield. Evan Plotkin tells Western Mass News the team drawing in crowds helps raise awareness of what's downtown, including the growing dining district. So I think sports... Uh, teams have a way of, of building loyalty to a city and to a place. He says if the T-Birds can keep up their winning ways, the momentum will far outlive this historic playoff run. It's going to galvanize the community to, to really be supportive of Springfield and their team and, and everything else that we have to offer here. And Puck Drop is in less than an hour now at 7.05 at the Mass Mutual Center. We'll be sure to keep you posted on tonight's result, both on air and on our free Western Mass News streaming app. And Western Mass News is your home for the Stanley Cup Finals. The Colorado Avalanche will try to stop the Tampa Bay Lightning from winning a third straight championship. Puck Drops for Game 1 of the Finals tonight at 8 p.m. on ABC 40. And Jana, I know.